for four, one fall. That is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. It is open challenge time here in Seattle. And it looks like we have our answer as to who will face Ilya Dragunov tonight. The first ever NXT United Kingdom Champion, Tyler Bate. Moved to Friday Night SmackDown when he accepted an open challenge for the Cruiserweight title back in December. And through the WWE Draft has made his way to Monday Night Raw. And what a big opportunity for Tyler Bate here on the red brand. Ilya dragging off the Invincible One, retained the Intercontinental title a few weeks ago at Backlash, defeating Shinsuke Nakamura. And dragging off no rest for the weary, wants to continue to defend the gold he won back at WrestleMania, throwing out this open challenge tonight. And it's going to be an international affair as Tyler Bate is here on Raw, and he's looking to leave Raw the new Intercontinental Champion. This should be a tremendous wrestling matchup which neither man is no stranger to. Especially when it comes to championship matches, these two men will fight as if their lives depend on it. We want to remind you yet again, ladies and gentlemen, that coming up on the Eve of Vengeance is a channel member exclusive event. You don't want to hit the channel member, join button down below, become a premium pass holder, so you do not miss out on that exclusive event 24 hours before Vengeance. But here comes your inter- Continental Champion, the Invincible, Ilya Dragunov. Dragunov won that gold back on WrestleMania Saturday in February when he defeated the Bruiserweight Pete Dunne. Retained it successfully as we previously mentioned against the King of Strong Style Shinsuke Nakamura at Backlash and what a hard hitting matchup it was. And Dragunov the competition only gets stiffer as he now gets in a challenge by Tyler Bate. And these two former NXT United Kingdom champions set to go one-on-one -on -one for the first time in the red brand ring and what stakes are at on the line. The Intercontinental Championship, this should be a hell of a matchup. And still to come tonight in your main event, Sami Zayn threw out the open challenge to Brock Lesnar. Lesnar accepted, and for the first time in nearly 20 years, the Beast Incarnate Brock Lesnar will be in a match here on Monday Night Raw in just a matter of moments in your main event. This is going to be a hell of a fight between Sami Zayn. I don't know if Sami Zayn's got a death wish or if he's the smartest man alive. We're going to find out in a matter of moments in your main event. But nonetheless, it is time for the Intercontinental Championship to be defended right here tonight. Climate Pledge Arena, Seattle, Washington, getting a treat. Tyler Bate, one-on-one -on -one with the invincible Ilya Dragunov for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. We're gonna send things down to the ring right now for your official pre-match introductions. Introducing the challenger from Dudley, England, weighing in at 175 pounds, Tyler Bates. And his opponent from Moscow, Russia, weighing in at 187 pounds, he is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Ilya Dre. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The stage is set, and the Intercontinental Championship is on the line. Dragging off throughout the open challenge, and he's got one hell of a challenger standing in front of him. Two former NXT United Kingdom champions set to clash live tonight in Seattle, and that is the prize that is at stake. This should be a fantastic professional wrestling matchup inside of that squared circle, and we don't got to wait any longer as the bell will sound. Right now, we are underway. The gold's on the line. It'll be very interesting to see how these two men try to get the upper hand throughout this matchup. Ilya Dragunov, I would say the harder hitter of the two. Tyler Bate, the more technically sound of the two. But at the end of the day, two fantastic athletes inside of that ring. This is certainly going to be a matchup where the better man will win in the end. You see Tyler Bate, as we mentioned, are the more technical prowess of the two. 
Already working over that arm of Ilya Dragunov. Dragunov going to avoid the strikes. Dragunov, for, as we mentioned, the harder hitter, if we had to guess, of these two men. Certainly a striker inside of that ring. Certainly made the matchup with Shinsuke Nakamura very interesting at Backlash. Now a little bit of a contrast in styles, if you will, here in Seattle on Raw. Dragunov wanted this challenge. He wants to defend his Intercontinental title against the best of them. And he is certainly getting the best of them in Tyler Bate tonight. Bait off the counter, look at this. Face first goes Dragunov, nearly head first. Like a nail right into the piece of wood, just going straight down. And Tyler Bate bringing the fight to Ilya Dragunov right now. And just imagine if Ilya Dragunov threw out this open challenge only for Tyler Bate to accept and walk away with the gold tonight. How would Dragunov be feeling coming out of Seattle tonight? Empty handed if that were the case. Tyler Bates certainly looking to make the most of this advantage here on Raw. Ilya Dragunov, on the other hand, has got other plans here. Coming off that re retain over Shinsuke Nakamura, that victory at Backlash. Wants to go 2-2 two two so far in Intercontinental Championship defenses. Back and forth since the opening bell. Dragunov now goes for the chop. Oh, look at that. Very nice by Dragunov. Faking out Tyler Bate. Bate went to duck. Dragunov caught him with the DDT. Only a one count there. Very strategic wrestling by Dragunov inside of that ring. Sends Tyler Bate into the corner. And Dragunov. Oh, look at this. We've seen this out of Ilya Dragunov plenty of times. The double lariats in the corner. Squashing his opponent. Immediately into the cover goes the invincible one. And Bate gets the shoulder up again. Dragunov trying to change the momentum of this matchup off those clotheslines. But Tyler Bate's got something else in mind. Flipping him off. There's a duck. Leapfrog. Nice big boot by Tyler. Tyler Bate, not the biggest competitor inside of that ring, giving up a little bit of size to Ilya Dragunov in the height advantage. I'd say Tyler Bate most likely the more powerful of the two. Nonetheless, and Dragunov avoids the big boot. Bate went to the well back-to-back -back times. Dragunov had it scouted, and you see that discus chop. And now Dragunov back on the offense here. Power slam. Well, that's not to go for the pinfall. I think Ilya Dragunov knows it's going to be tough to keep Tyler Bate down in this match. You gotta wonder after the matchup we saw earlier tonight between Apollo Crews and Cedric Alexander, two men who would love the challenge for the Intercontinental title, do they have their eyes on this match between Dragunov and Tyler Bate? And what about the man who called out Ilya Dragunov a couple of weeks ago, LA Knight, who defeated Shinsuke Nakamura here on Raw? Do those two men got their eyes on this Intercontinental Championship affair? We'll see in due time who will step up after this, but right now Dragunov off the springboard lariat, three slaps to the face, and another one. Down goes Tyler into the cover here to retain the gold, not just yet. Extremely hard-hitting affair so far for the Intercontinental Championship. Dragunov sending Tyler Bate in the corner. Will he go for those lariats again, or will he try to mix up the offense here? Corkscrews the knee. Obviously, both men wrestling with exposed knees right now. No knee pads inside of that ring, so those kind of maneuvers certainly going to do a little bit extra damage than normal. There's one thing about Ilya Dragunov, and even Tyler Bate, we could say the same. There's really no waste in motion between these two participants. They are two pound-for-pound pound incredible wrestlers inside of that ring, especially with the gold on the line. They're going to give it their absolute best as Tyler Bate starting to build momentum here in Seattle. The crowd coming unglued for the young man. Look at that springboard elbow. Takes Dragunov down. And as Tyler Bate moving one step closer to leaving Monday Night Raw tonight, the new Intercontinental Champion. Getting Dragunov up. Suplex there. Simple yet effective maneuver. Bate starting to build some momentum. Snap mare and down goes the champion again. Will the first ever NXT United Kingdom champion be adding to his resume tonight as he's wrenching in that exposed knee on the lower back of Tyler Bate. And it's got the jaw locked. Referee's got to make sure those hands don't slip underneath the jaw and turn it into a choke with Dragunov. You see Dragunov able to get out of it. And as we mentioned a few minutes ago, no waste in motion by either of these competitors. The champion right back on the offense. Tyler Bates down now. Dragunov. Going to the middle buckle here, and goes for the knee. Not sure if he got all of it there, at least got enough into the cover to retain, and Tyler Bate gets the shoulder up. 
Back and forth. The pendulum momentum continues to swing in this Intercontinental Championship battle. And drag it off now. Sitting Tyler Bate atop the ropes. And what has the champion got in mind for his challenger here this evening? I could be looking for a... Oh, wait a minute. Going for a superplex there. Tyler Bate may have cost himself the chances of becoming champion, not just yet. Tyler Bate able to get the shoulder up. And Seattle showing their appreciations off that suplex variation by Dragunov. Almost had Tyler, but not just yet. Bates showing that heart, showing that resilience, showing that intestinal fortitude and the will to become Intercontinental Champion as Dragunov pops up with a bare knee to the jawline of Tyler Bate to retain. Will that do it this time? And again, Tyler Bate gets the shoulder up and the matchup is not over yet. And bait off the reversal. Will the challenger begin to build some momentum? Springboard, clothesline, signature by Tyler Bate. And he may have just won himself gold here in Seattle, not just yet as Dragunov survives. What a matchup we got on our hands for the Intercontinental Championship. Vintage fake out by Tyler Bate there. Suplex takes down the champion. Oh, wait a minute. Bates going to the top rope. He could be looking for that corkscrew. Vintage out of the moveset of Tyler Bate. Miscalculated a little bit there. Luckily, Dragunov does not even have his wits about him yet. Look at Tyler. Not going to get down on that misstep. Continuing on the offense. Dragunov rolling to the outside to try to catch a breather. We find ourselves at a stalemate. What has been an incredible Intercontinental Championship match. Back on the offense. Look at Dragunov unloading here. He's been back and forth since the opening bell. Dragunov again takes him down. And when we start to get in the championship rounds here, deep waters as we like to call them, how much more do these two gentlemen got left in the tank? They got to be running on E at some point, but at the end of the day, the adrenaline and the will to become champion is really what pushes you to the deep rounds of this matchup and allows you to survive. Nice takedown by Dragunov there. And you see the champion starting to rally Seattle once again. The crowd might be split. Half for Dragunov, half for Tyler Bate. Two fan favorites here on Monday Night Raw, but only one can leave with the Intercontinental Championship. What a chop! And a counter by Bate. Tyler Bate can only withstand so many of those strikes. Knows he had to avoid it and take it a move out of Pete Dunn's maneuver there. And drag it off with a counter. And here we go again, back and forth. Look at that maneuver. Senton. Drag it off, starting to put the pieces together. And starting to do it fast here. Tyler Bate is all kinds of dazed and confused as he's eating elbows to the back, eating elbows to the spine. Dragging off. Wait a minute. In the corner. Could be looking for the torpedo from Moscow. Torpedo hits. Into the cover. That'll do it. What a matchup for the Intercontinental Championship. And even after the open challenge, getting thrown off by his challenger tonight. Tyler Bate putting up a performance. Dragunov retains here in Seattle. Here is your winner, and still WWE Intercontinental Champion, Ilya Dragunov. Pete Dunne at WrestleMania. Shinsuke Nakamura at Backlash. Tyler Bate tonight on Raw. Who will be next to step up to Ilya Dragunov for the Inner Continental Championship? Song when I chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back. I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat. Gonna see me rise if you hate on that. I don't play both sides, doing me no cap. I'm around.